Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Brittany and today we are going to plan out the week of December 20th and or through the 26th. Before we do get started on the planning, I do have a giveaway for you guys on YouTube. Um, the first thing I am going to give away is this little bag of little freebies that I have. They are used, so they are partially used. Some stickers are gone, but most of them are still completely usable. The next thing to go with it is this whole stack of leftovers. Now some, um, there is some that are almost full pages. They're from Simply Smith Stickers, Orange Umbrella Co., Maisie McCrazy, Cricut Paper Co., uh, Planner Kate, I just, um, Erin Condren, just a whole bunch of leftovers. And like you can see, you can definitely still use all of this. Find a way to use it. I just, there's a lot of it that I won't be using and I can't use. So, you know, make your own kits with it. Like that one only has one missing. There's just a ton here. So definitely for a new planner or something would be beneficial to you and will help me kind of declutter my stickers. So all you have to do to enter that is obviously subscribe to my channel, like this video, and comment your New Year's goals. That could be planner-wise, that could be health-wise, that could be, you know, anything you would like. But yeah, that's basically it for the giveaway. And it'll probably end on the 23rd, and I'll pick a winner on the 24th. Um, but I think that is it. Let's go ahead and get into this plan with me. This kit is from Simply Smith Stickers. I did already lay down the base, so her full boxes are here. And then I just used this um, Rose Colored Days little washi. You have all of these sheets in her kit. And we will just go ahead and get started. I don't know if you have seen on my Instagram, but I haven't really been on there all week. Last week was crazy. I don't know if your kids came home with it or what, but um, my kids stayed home from Wednesday to... Sorry, I'm trying to think what I want to do here. I want to mark no school because they are on break this week. I think I'm going to do washi. Anyways, so my kids were home from Wednesday to Friday because Tuesday night we got a call around 11 p.m., so not normal, about a possible school shooting. And it freaked me out. <laughs> Obviously, I wanted to keep my, home, my kids home and safe. And even if it was, you know, just a joke or whatever, I would just rather them be home than to worry about, you know, the other. So they were home and nothing happened Wednesday, nothing happened Friday or Thursday, but then Friday they actually got a bomb threat at their school and they had to evacuate the high school and, um moved them to the junior high which is right across the parking lot and they did end up finding a kid and took him into custody i'm assuming he was 15 and it's crazy so uh i guess it all started on tiktok or something i have no idea but not a fan so immediately you know after i saw that i went through my son's phone and i'm like deleting all these apps and he's like what are you doing i was like you don't need that anymore you don't need this anymore but yeah i just tried to explain to him what was going on and he's like well i haven't seen anything i haven't heard anything and i was like well i just want to do this for you know my my thinking here and he understood and He's like, well, I just watch it for fun. And I was like, yeah, but I can't control what you see on there. So it's just best if you don't. So anyways, no school, trash day, and then I do have to work. Sorry, that was a whole, a whole thing. But my week, it was just, even though my kids were not at school, I, like, I was on pins and needles the whole day. And I was like, you know. I, just, I don't know. It was just, it's just a weird thing. And it's a weird thing to have to think about. Like, I don't think that should be even an issue, but it is. So 
let's see what I want to do. So I have to go to work and then my son, my oldest son does have basketball practice. My middle child does not all week. So I kind of want to do more washi. I kind of really like using this washi as like a box, like a background. But anyways, that's how my week, my week went. Um, nothing too much else happened. Um, I did not go. I had a Christmas concert to go to, my middle son, and obviously I did not go to that because it was on Thursday and I just didn't feel safe if there was going to be, you know, a group of people and whatever was going to happen. I just felt it was better to keep him home. He did sing us the songs in the living room. So he's like, well, what I remember because he's been out for two weeks with a double ear infection. So poor kid, he's been, he's going to be missing about a month of school now, but he's all about it. He doesn't really care. He's, he's only in second grade, so they'll make it up. But it was just funny. Now also for this week, we do not have um, my night classes. So I will just be working out at home so i have this little exercise script and then i will just be doing arms here so i'll do like upper body lower body upper body kind of like that so i think that is it for monday let me see no school work oh my husband is i'm sorry if you can hear my kids are playing on the stairs i told my husband i was coming down here but you know that doesn't work. I need to find my day off stickers and then we will uh, go to Tuesday. All right, so for Tuesday, I did put that day off sticker down here. For Tuesday, it's just no school and then I do have to work. Not much going on in the mornings. Not much going on really all this week. I'm sure my kids will get their game fix in since they're not allowed to play usually during the week. So basketball practice and then here. And I'll probably walk about a mile or so every night plus some extra exercises. That's it for Tuesday. We don't, we really don't have a lot to do. Let's go ahead and go to Monday. Same thing. Work. Now I am going to try to move over some of my hours on Friday, for Friday, so I don't have to work. I still have to figure that out. But... Let's see, my husband works Tuesday and then Wednesday as well. I'll do that while I'm over here. And then we will have to do basketball practice. I still, I think it's really weird that they are still having practice while they're on vacation, but whatever. This coach, I don't know, not a fan, but we just have to make it through this year. And they're, his eighth grade coach is awesome so just kind of make it through and <laughs> hopefully we make it i don't know i do need to get a steps sticker there too but that's it for the beginning of the week let's go ahead and move on to thursday okay let's do their no school this here we did have, did I use a red up here? Nope, sure didn't. Use the chevron. Good catch. Anyways, we did have a whole bunch planned for this weekend with Christmas and everything, but my sister ended up getting sick. And unfortunately, she did test positive. I haven't seen her in a couple weeks. We've just been talking on the phone, but she called me sometime last week. And she just sounded awful and she just thought because we always get like bronchitis always every single year we all get it and we just thought it was that and then she started having you know other symptoms so she went ahead and got tested and it did come up positive i told her i was like 
I didn't have any of that. Like when I had it a year and a half ago, I was just dead tired. Like someone ran me over with the bus. Like I lost my taste and my smell, but that is it. Just slept all day. My husband had to take off work because I just I physically could not even get up. And that was it. The next day I was fine, completely fine. Oh, I don't wanna work this day. Luckily with my uh, work, I can make my own schedule. So I will not be working that day. All right, so Thursday, I just wanna do this. And then this is going to be really boring playing with me. I apologize. I do want to get some cleaning done, so I might have to move that up. I did pull out a cleaning sticker. But anyways, so we are pushing that back because my stepdad has a lot of health problems anyways. So he, you know, better, better safe than sorry. Okay, and then I do want to do... I want to put this on. It's blue. That would be good. So I do need to clean because we're going to be gone Friday. And I just want a clean house. So I'm going to use this sticker here. And I have a little doodle girl. Those are both from Simply Smith stickers. What are we doing here? Uh, basketball. And we will be home for basketball there. Need to work out. Um, today in real time, it is Saturday. And I spent four and a half hours making some cookies. I do not bake. I don't like to bake. But... I figured, you know, to give out to all my cousins for and stuff for Christmas. I, everything that could go wrong did go wrong. <laughs> and I was just, it was a bad time. It was a bad time. They turned out fine, but literally like a spoon broke. My mixer broke. Um, my first batch of cookies, This why we have a new oven since we moved. And the temperature that my recipe calls for completely burned them. I was like, okay, well, this is a newer stove, so maybe just... Bump it down a little bit, but oh my gosh, it was, <laughs> it was awful. Um, I think that's it for Thursday. But they are done and everything is good and well. Okay, so for Friday, it is Christmas Eve. So let's do, we're going to be back in time for practice. We have to be at his dad's at noon. I'm going to put that down here because I want to put that Christmas Eve sticker up there. All right. So I have this little coffee cup. I don't know where they're from. I have a couple of them that I'll be using, but I want to use that there. And then I want to use this candy cane up here. It's going to be super busy, but it's fine. Up here. For the Christmas Eve sticker. Isn't that so cute? Now, crap. Do I want to do that? I don't know. I don't know if I want to do that. Let's, let's change this up because we are going to watch a Christmas movie we do every year. We do the get them pajamas, make popcorn, hot chocolate, and then we watch a movie. So let's do that. Maybe we'll put the Christmas Eve in here. Yeah. That'll work. That's cute. All right. So we are going to do this little, I don't even know what you call it. So we're going to put that in. And then Simply Smith the Stickers does have a movie, um, Christmas movie list. I'm going to try and get this on there as best as I can. They decided they want to watch The Santa Claus, which obviously... I love that because it's one of my favorite movies. 
So we're going to do that, go to his dad's, and then we will watch a movie that night. And my husband is off. Thankfully, he wasn't going to be. And yeah, I think that's it for Friday. All right, so for Christmas, let's try it on the Christmas because we put that here and the Merry Christmas, oh, all the candy canes. I don't know about all that. Might be a little bit too much, even for me. Let's see, do I have, cool, I'll use this one. Merry Christmas in there. And then it is my cousin Chris's birthday. So we put that there. That's from Planner Kate. Her little dotted things. And then this little candle is from Simply Smith Stickers. And then we do have um, his mom is actually coming here here for Christmas. So after we open up all of our gift, she will be here for that. Doing it with her and my husband's sister. So we're going to put this here. And then I thought what would be cute is Simply Smith stickers in her shop has this um, sheet and it just has a whole bunch of funny kind of Christmas things. And I kind of wanted to put this one here. It says naughty, nice, and I tried. I thought that was super cute. So I think that's it for Saturday. Yes, let's move on to Sunday. All right, so I am going to put this here, but I don't know if I will be working. She, I do a private client every other weekend, and his daughter called me and said he is just... He's not making it through this cancer and he's getting worse. So I haven't heard back from her. So I don't know how he's doing, but I will put that in there um, just in case. I do work that day and then my husband also does work. And then for the rest of the day, I will just need to... Oh, the heater. Uh, I'll be right back. All right, now that that is done, sorry, I apologize for that. But on Sunday... I don't even know where we were. I just, we're going to do one of these checklists here. There, and then one of these. And to do. And then I will have to plan and then get groceries sometime. And also finish up laundry. And then this little guy is from Nightingale Paper Pro. So I think that is it for stickers. Let's see. I think that's it. Let's go ahead and write some stuff in. Let me flip this back over. Okay, so I will work early for this. So probably 9.30 to 2.30 would be my guess. And then Tuesday is the same. It would be 8.30 to 11.15. Wednesday, 10.30 to 2.30. And then Thursday, oh my gosh, my kid, 8.30 to 11.15. <clears throat> and then on the 24th is going to be John's at 12 o'clock. And then Crispy Day. Make sure to text him. And then... Tracy's Christmas. And then if I do work here, it'll be 9 o'clock to 12. I think that is it. Now I do want to add a couple more of these.
stickers here. This one says, on the naughty list and I regret nothing. I think that's kind of cute. Maybe over here. This one says, Lo joy, love, peace, believe, and Christmas. I think since all of these are kind of busy, we'll just stick one right in the middle. Um, <laughs> Let's, uh, it still hasn't snowed yet, so that's crazy. We did have lots of winds when that tornado went by, but no snow yet. Let's do... Huh, <laughs> Santa, why you be judging? That's funny. I don't know if we'll fit there, but we're gonna try. Oh yeah, that's hilarious. Love it. All right, that is this week's spread. Sorry, it was kind of crazy with my heater going in and out, but don't forget about that giveaway. All you have to do is subscribe to this channel, like this video, and then comment your New Year's goals. I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.